Yeah, it was super fun. I was hitting my driver really well. I could have putted a little bit better. I had a few three putts, but it was fun overall. I had a good day. I think this course is quite easy for me because like my distance, I think my distance, my strengths for today. Uh, I told myself just stay in the moment. Don't worry about your score. Um, your score will speak for itself. So I shot five under and now I'm in the lead. And so now I feel good about where my score is at and that's where it put me. I was trying to keep myself really, like my mind pretty clean in the front nice. I didn't think about anything. I just tried to just, like follow my strategies step by step. Not really checking the leaderboard, just trying to hit a good shot, doing just really doing what my swing changes. Like, I have a few feelings and I'm just trying to make sure I do them and if the ball goes where I want, then cool. But, you know, I'm just really focusing on that for the long term right now, so. So, just when I went out there again and uh, uh, after the rain delay, I just tried to, just, I just to I kept, told, kept telling myself, um, you have to be calm. You still got like two, two strokes or three strokes lit. So you have to be calm right now. You don't want to take any risk anymore. You just, Keep it going. It was a great playoff. Hats off to Connor. Uh, he played great today. Hit a lot of good shots. Um, made me do what I had to do and uh, pressured me down the stretch and played well. To qualify into this event means a lot because I'm kind of new to like the whole AJGA scene and I qualified into one a couple weeks ago so to do it again just shows that like my hard work is paying off and it's kind of motivating as well. I feel very happy and pretty excited leading. I put up a good number so I hope to continue that. It's created a lot of opportunities, hopefully it helps get me into a really good college. I would like to play golf in college as well and I've just met a lot of great people through it and a lot of friends and it's been overall a great experience. Uh, feels good but still got two more rounds. The competition's great here and so just got to keep playing steady golf, keep playing my golf and not worry about the competition, just focus on playing for myself. I'm very happy, kind of nervous, but I hope to just go out and play my game tomorrow and hopefully put up a really good number that will overall win it. Exemption would mean a lot to me actually. It would open up a lot of opportunities and I would also like to play in the LPGA tournament. That would mean a lot to me. Dana does a great job with this event every year. Uh, it's really an honor to be playing this event. They put on a great show every year and it really does not go unappreciated. Obviously it means a lot winning at AJGA is definitely always a big achievement. I think the fact that there's an exemption for you know an LPGA event, um, obviously it's even better. I like have been struggling this summer a little bit with some like mental blocks so like this is definitely like a breakthrough. A few people asked like how much pressure I felt hitting into the like last screen with I think I my, I think I had the lead by like a shot or two that 18th hole I think the drive is the most intimidating part so after I was like in the fairway honestly all the pressure was like kind of gone so I was just trying to like get on the green and two putt the fact that it went in was like even better. I mean, winning my first AJGA at Kansas City last year was really special to me, and winning my second one today, it just feels incredible. Winning at AJGA is always very tough. Um, the field is always pretty good. It takes a lot mentally to be able to win one of these. Thank you to Dana Incorporated for sponsoring this week. Um, we wouldn't be able to play without without their support. It's a big, um, big thank you to them for supporting Junior Golf here. I never really experienced like an AJGA qualifier, like something like this. So it was a really good opportunity. I think there's certain places where you know you can't miss, um, and off tees, especially here, you know the lines where to go, um, and just subtleties in the greens. You know that, so that that's definitely helped me. I played with one of my good friends this today, so it was really easy to keep loose and just having fun on the course. Actually, surprise. Yeah, I'm not looking at this leaderboard this, this whole round, so it's kind of like playing my own goal. Like winning tournaments as defending champion, I feel like it's such an honor and it's such a great feeling, like knowing that you did this last year and you did it again, and I hope that I can do it next year as well. A lot of good approach shots, everything into the greens was going the way I wanted it to go. Um, 
a couple putts I left out there, but happy the way I hit the ball. Our wedge game's been good throughout the year, so that was definitely the strength of the game and helped me hit a couple close. The best part of my game today was putting. I made all the putts inside 10 feet and it was just, I was just feeling great about my putting and really confident. AJG staffs are really friendly and nice and they, uh, they're always there when you need help. There's literally one staff like per hole and they help you when you need and they're really nice. It means a lot for me to win this event because it's definitely a confident boost. I haven't been playing so well recently, so. This course is pretty short, so I think I could have drove most of the greens here, so that was nice. I finished second here last year, and last week I finished second again, so it was just nice, nice to get the W this week. I hit my driver really well, so it gave me a lot of wedge wedge shots because this course is pretty short. So uh, I was confident with my wedges and stuck close a lot of times, so I'd kick in birdies. It just set up well for me. Um, a lot of the tee shots I felt comfortable over and into the greens, I, I had some good numbers today, so I was able to hit some good shots. I think it did pretty good under like the windy conditions and everything. I think I was pretty consistent, so it was good enough for me. I love meeting the people, honestly. All the HGA staff is so amazing, as well as like going to travel all around the country has been really cool too. I mean, I got off to a good start with a birdie and uh, the putter just got rolling through that first nine holes and just kind of went off from there. It's so lucky today because um, on, on the first R5, uh, it's the downwind so I, I drive it pretty good and then I use my three wood and just went onto the green and like it left about three or four yards for my eagle putt and then I made it and then I made a birdie on the next hole so the wind actually helped me a lot today. You know, uh, so my hitting was there and then my putting was like okay on the first front nine and then and when I started to get on the back nine, it started to like get better and better. And then, yeah, I just started like making putts and everything. I'm very grateful for the staff and the volunteers for like making us play on this wonderful tournament. And like the course is in like good condition, so like it's like pretty good. It means a lot. I mean, I got in the qualifier as an alternate and just being able to see the course to play these great conditions and to compete against these boys is really fun, yeah. Well, today's round was actually like the best round I've ever shot or played. And yesterday's my putting was there. And this, yet today, my putting's like there, there. And like, so my putting saved me today. Very well, like, I have like 20 something putts. Yeah, made like a lot of one putts around the green. But I got lucky that I'm 11, make like an eagle to jump to 600. That makes my confidence like high. After nine, I told myself, hey, this is a new round. I want to just like par, par, and maybe even birdie some holes, like the par fives I wanted to take advantage. I didn't, but um, thankfully I did birdie two par fours. But yeah, um, coming into this round, I was like, I was like, whatever, like, don't think too much of it, because if, if I do, I knew I was going to mess up, and I didn't want to do that, so yeah. It, it was fun. It was a fun tournament. Like, I I've been improving on short games a lot, so really paid off. I'm having a bag now, like last week I didn't get a bag, so I can sh like show, to show my friends around with my bag. Feels amazing. I've worked a lot. I've worked really hard to um, win this week, and I told my friends that I was going to come back with the red back this week, and I'm really happy that I did that. I have a few more AJGs coming up, and if in the next few weeks, so I'm hoping that I will be able to carry my experiences of not being nervous, of um, trying to keep calm on the course and not make any mistakes. I think I'm just trying to like keep that, keep the flow going onto my next tournament.